Hey guys. So this is our first day that our area, or Florida, all of Florida, is allowed to not have to stay at home. So we came out to one of the parks by the Pensacola Bay. Bay. The Pensacola Bay. Just to walk around and get some fresh air. And it's kind of nice. There's other people here taking in some fresh air. I think we've been cooped up way too long. <laughs> we want out. We want out. So we're going to just enjoy. It's really pretty out here. It's beautiful. It's, weather is awesome. Kind of special. Kind of nice. we've been cooped up in our we've been grounded <laughs> we are just let free from our grounding I can't just I can't tell you how delightful it is out here I mean I, I can tell you but I don't think you could understand until unless you were here but it is nice out it's beautiful out here No breeze. All right, I realize that I've showed the beach <laughs> uh, a lot these days, but I am sitting at the beach and it's early morning. I have my coffee and it's very calm. There's actually hardly any wind and uh, the sun is warm already. It's going to be a hot day today. I just thought I'd give you a little snippet of our beach today. Not, I won't spend a lot of time, but I couldn't resist. I had to come down. Because there's like no wind and really just very calm waves. <laughs> it's not often like this. It does feel good. It's warm. It's going to be a hot day for sure. The sand is cool right now, so if you dig your feet in, it feels really good. Fix it for a good day. Very good start of the day. All right, so this is about eight o'clock in the morning. Uh, it's gonna be a busy day, I just know it. It's hot and it's lovely out. Uh, perfect, perfect day for the beach. But right now it's, is definitely not very busy, which is nice. All right, so we're gonna head back up. It's been really nice to come down and see the ocean after so many weeks of not being able to. I hope you guys had a great day and a great weekend and we'll catch you soon. Bye. <laughs> All right, hey you guys. Um, so if it's not one thing, it's at another. <laughs> we're, we're at home today, working from home. And um, we hear on the news that there are two fires, two like, field fires. I don't know if it was um, partly a, like a controlled burn and then it got out of control. Well, there's one, you know, a few miles away um, and then there's one uh, closer. So they're actually having to evacuate several people uh, because their houses are in danger of getting in the path of the fire, <laughs> which is crazy. We, we typically, I don't know, I mean, it, to me it seems like maybe it's just drier than normal and this just happened. But it's breezy and windy and so they're concerned um, that that's going to happen. And so I stepped outside just to kind of see what I could see from my visual. I can't see the one that's a little further away, although there's kind of a haze that way. So that's probably what it is. But it smells like campfire. It smells like smoke. These houses, there is um, some darker clouds that way, which is not too far from, from our house. 
so um yeah we're just kind of watching the news to see what the deal is and hopefully they get it under control soon but honestly the, the <laughs> there's enough excitement here we don't need fires as well as all the other stuff that we're dealing with so anyway that is our story thought i would share it with you guys you know what can i do just an update on our local fires um there were two in our area and then there was one a little east of us in a city called Destin or San Destin and um, the one that's um, near us I guess apparently one of them crossed a major highway yesterday and they are rerouting all the local traffic on or the freeway through um, a little town <laughs> and a little road uh, to get around that so it's just kind of crazy <laughs> you wouldn't think something like that would happen but they actually closed the highway both directions and they're rerouting traffic so hopefully that will be contained today and they can move on um, open up the highway and get things going but it's just kind of interesting that they're sending them through it's actually not too far from us um, from our house where they're sending that through and yeah so that is the story.